Hey, what's going on guys? Ravi here from Mirai FX along with Mr. Zebo. Welcome you to another Adobe Premiere Pro tutorial. So, in this video we'll be learning to make this Superman flying effect in Adobe Premiere Pro in a very simple way. So without any delay, let's get started. Alright, so let us first divide this tutorial into three steps. Step 1, shooting the scene. Step 2, animating the fly effect. And step 3, adding final touches. So, I have a video here. Let me drag this onto the right side panel here so that a sequence is created. So in the first step, all you have to do is shoot a video something like this. Place your camera on a tripod and act as if you're flying just like Superman and move out of the scene just so that uh, we'll have an empty footage in the end that we can use as a background. Yep, this is how we should act. And in order to create a background, uh, let me right click at this frame and insert an um, add frame hold so that I get this particular frame freezed that I can use it as a background so I'll move this to the top and uh, move this to the start just so that I will drag the drag this to the right let me just rename this to background click OK so the next thing that I'll be doing is in order to animate the fly effect I'll create a freeze frame I'll freeze one particular frame of this one at this point I'll right click here and again click on this add frame hold so now this particular frame is is freezed like this so we'll animate this particular section so now make sure that the frame is selected here and go to the effect controls and uh, make sure you click on this pen tool here and start masking the character like this it does not have to be really very perfect but let me just zoom in a bit and start masking so it doesn't have to be really very perfect but a clear outline would actually do our work Alright, so once I mask the layer, if I uh, toggle the uh, background, you can just see that character mask just like this. So if I like this, I can see the background as well. Now all you have to do is go to the position section of uh, the freezed frame. Click on this timer here so that a keyframe is created at this point for this particular layer. Move, to, move a couple of frames forward just like around 10 frames and move the y axis value just like this so that the character or the mask moves outside of our um, video if i start playing this this is how our animation is going to look like this looks good to me the only thing that is missing is the blur effect that the character has to have when he's moving I mean when he's flying so I'll go to the FX panel and simply type blur so I think we'll we should be using this um, Gaussian blur drag this Gaussian blur onto our mask like this and increase the blur value to around 5 or I think 15 looks good we have some blur effect applied here if I start playing this this is how it's going to look like looks good to me the final thing that is left is to add some uh, um, element to it just so, so that it looks natural so I have this uh, smoke shockwave effect that I actually downloaded from production crate so production crate has got some amazing visual effects 
uh, elements that you can add and uh, i'm actually adding this shockwave one of the shockwave that you can download for free do check out the link in the description for the same so let me drag this smoke layer onto the top of our layers just like this and if i start playing this this is how it's going to look like let me adjust the element here so let me actually scale this element let me select this and reduce the scale just like this this looks good and let me just put this at this point just so that it will look as if the smoke is starting as soon as the character starts taking off and then also reduce the opacity around to 50% just so that or I think 65% would look good so just so that it looks quite natural let me play this yep this looks good to me and this is how you make this superman flying effect in adobe premiere pro i hope you like this video and uh, if you'd like to talk to me regarding visual effects and uh, video editing you can always connect with me on instagram at vfx guy ravi and mr zebo would you like to add something subscribe for more tutorials Alright, so see you guys next time with another tutorial.